What's up, guys? Double R 25. And welcome back to Baseball Superstar 2022 season. Uh, I wanted to do something a little different today. I had a, a, a comment down below and it was asking uh, how to do something. So before, I mean, I don't think I'm going to play anything today. I think more of what I'm going to do is explain what can you do in Baseball Superstar 2022 season, you know? Uh, there's a lot to do. I mean, if you're just starting off brand new, have no idea, like you just downloaded this, I can understand because I've been through that. You have no idea what to do. So let's go and do just that. So on the top left corner over here, you see Lexter's Lab, Owner's Guide, Custom Shop, and Community. Um, first thing I believe is going to do the Owner's Guide. This is where you're going to do, basically learn how to play. Um, in order to, let me go back here, in order to play the develop on the bottom right corner and some stuff, you got to do the owner's guide first. As you can see, I mean, hold up, uh, let me get this out of the way. As you can see here, I have some of these rewards that I have not picked up yet. Uh, but what you really want to do is the basic guide stage one. That's what you got to do first. Just uh, upgrade trainers. It's basically showing you how to play the game. Once there then you can start playing the game. You know, you, you have what you call play mode, and in there are different types. You have Planet League, uh, Superstar League, Clash, uh, Live Clash, Daily Game, Mini Game, and let's start from the very top. Lion Galaxy Cup. That is something that happens, I think, once a month or something. I have not played it, but I'm going to this, um, this week it starts in seven days so right now i've been making characters you can see georgie bell cj um i need to have two more which is the uh, shortstop and the uh, uh center uh closing pitcher i'm sorry and so I, I need to make those guys in order to do that though i'm getting ahead of myself but i'm gonna show you how to create characters too uh next one we got the planet league this is where uh it's kind of like um, if you ever play Super, uh, Baseball Super 2013, how it had, um, I'll show you right now, hold up. Uh, the, um, classic mode, right there in the bottom right corner, as you can see. That's kind of like this one's game, the, the Planet League. It's just more of, you have to play each and every one, easy, medium, large, very hard, and basically you just get the rewards. Nothing too crazy, but... If you're kind of playing alone, you know, trying to be the very best, I would say do that. Uh, versus mode, which is the base uh, superstar league I've never played before. Um, as you can tell, you'll play against other players, um, probably their league. Uh, you have that as well. Um, going through this, I have not played. I'm not going to start it. I might do it next time. Live clash. Uh, I think you play someone live, as you can tell, live mode. Daily game, this is where you get to do, um, like, get your reward. So you can play easy, medium, and large. If you win, you get the reward, you know? So there's that there. Then little mini games. Uh, little mini games you can just get so you can get, like, uh, 50 uh, diamonds or 45,000 coins. But that's basically the play mode. So you also have develop. Now, develop is how you create... Um, your players not trainers players so in order to create players you gotta click um, the challenge Hold on, this is mine right here so you have multiple ways to develop players and you play the individual teams to make players so whoever player you make let's say if it's with the forest elves his he'll be in that team the forest elves and that's important because if you go back to the the tourney mode this is the lion galaxy cup so only the lions can play in here so if you wanted to play that let's just say if you were making that you would have to go to the develop and you would have to develop with the perfect lions or else they wouldn't go through so the other one is if you go and develop you can also develop with the classic mode that's the one that I've been playing. That's like the 2013, the original OG one that uh, you've been seeing me play on here. With those covered, now we're going to talk about the bottom left side of it. So, the very beginning one, you have trainers. What are trainers? 
Trainers are what you use when you develop players. So when you develop players, I'll just show you right here. I'm not gonna do it real quick, but I'll show you. Uh, let's just give him a random name, uh, Hill. We'll call him Hill. And then let's just say if you wanted to do this. So you click next, and then there you can see the top players that you have. Typically you can use the top players, but once you get a constant amount, and you can pick the ones that are perfect for your players. So what I mean by that is you can see position, so CF, so all of these people are for the CF and then by tier. But I use my best players because those are the best ones to help me out. So let me go back real quick. So that is trainers. Um, index is just, you know, getting your collection, seeing the people who you have. Uh, as you collect uh, trainers, you unlock some of these things. So it'll raise your stats up in your, uh, in your team. With that, you gotta manage cores. So these cores will help uh, boost your trainer. So I'll show you one right now. I think she has one. So she's my top person right now. And see how the, she has cores right there? So she has two cores there. She can get another one, but I'm gonna wait for it. I'm not gonna do it right now because I, I like to think about it and, and uh, uh, see for myself. Um, you can also, for trainers, I'm just gonna show you here for this person right here. Um, I have Helen and two Helen, so you can upgrade them. You click on their level, level one right here. You click upgrade, and I'm just gonna upgrade them real quick. So you click on it, and you see how she's getting all those uh, um, levels. So she's getting stronger, basically, to say like that. Once you do that, then because I have another one of their people, you can unlock their potential. Not unlock potential. I'm sorry. Uh, click on their level, and then you can upgrade her. Since I have one more picture of her, I'll use uh, one of my little things, but you can click it and voila. So now she's stronger. Because of this, you can now upgrade her some more. So see, she's in their max. And you can keep on doing that. So if you get another person, then you can upgrade her some more, all the way up to five. There's more stuff to this. Uh, trust me, there's a whole lot more that I'm not talking about. Of course, the course, you can upgrade the supers. I'm not gonna upgrade hers though. But that's how you see that. That's the trainers. And then you can also trade um, your players or you can make them into cubes. I'll show you what a cube does right now. So you can click on the bottom right corner, um, just auto thing. Do that right there. Oh, I didn't wanna, I didn't wanna do that. That's not what I wanna do. Damn, that's fine. Uh, I'll convert her to his cube. So you turn into a cube and then it gives you some cubes. And with those cubes, I'll show you in a bit, but you can open them and it'll give you items. Now, um, with that, there's not really a, uh, other than like for here, you can like move your different trainers who you want to put on the, the starting lineup on there or not. That will help in another thing I'll talk about in a bit. But from there, you go to players. So with players, oh, I'm sorry, I dropped my thing. Dang it. With players, you can manage your team, and this is where you can put the new people you developed on your team. So you see right here, you I have Captain Price, or I call him Price. His name's Captain Price from uh, uh, Modern Warfare. You can change him out. So I have Ron right here. I can change him out, and you can swap. And there you go. So now he's there. I'm gonna auto assign and it's gonna put all my best players on and there we go see so all my best players are there so that's how you change so you can click on someone you can swap them out and see I have him here and you can swap them see or you can just click auto assign and I'll put the best players on there for you uh, that was one of the questions that I had on uh, my comments uh, that's how you do that but you can only do that if you develop players and that's what I've learned Team Mastery, uh, this is basically like getting your players better if you have the books for it. So see, I have a book here. I'm going to learn it right now. Boom, learn. And there we go, I learned that. There's a whole lot, so you got a lot to go. And the things, like it says, like this one, uh, throw active roster by five, so it gets them a little bit better. They just like upgrades, little upgrades. Manage players, so it shows you all your players. I'm going uh, to delete some of these people soon. I'm actually going to sell them right now. 
Because I don't know what happens when you sell. Okay, so you just get gold. So I'm assuming the better players you do, the more gold you get. So that's a good way to farm, if you will. Uh, some gold, but I don't think gold is really a problem here. Um, missions. The missions just give you like, um, kind of like your daily things to do and your weekly things to do. So if you play the game, you'll probably unlock these on your own. As you can tell, I haven't really touched them yet. So there we go. Now, mm, let's keep on going down before I start talking about something else. Inventory shows you what you have. So this is where the items cubes. Remember the ones that we made? You can open it up and voila, it gives you items. And that's basically it. See? And there we go. So you can keep on doing that. Uh, I would definitely check here uh, what y'all have because sometimes you have like this, like the SSR uh, ticket so I can use it and I'll get a player. And sometimes when you have the Ultra, that's what you're shooting for. You're shooting for the Ultra Rares for sure. And then finally the shop. I don't usually go into the shop a lot because they usually cost money. You can go to just the regular items. And you see here, uh, you can buy 10 here. I don't really want to, but trade ball, schedule. I'm going to buy a schedule because the schedules are pretty good. But yeah, that's all those right there. You can see the meadows, different planet meadows. Uh, things like that, Galaxy Meadows. Those are, I'm assuming, from playing like the Superstar Planet Galaxy. You get those and you can use them there. So that's a reason why to play those. I have this here. I don't know what this is called. I'm sorry. Claim. Uh, okay, it's so just a regular daily reward. And then finally, events. So I would just check in here, see how it would just day 19 uh, claim, claim, claim. Not too big. You just gotta click on them and get them. So that's that. So that's that's it for the bottom right. I did the bottom left. I did the top left. Now finally, how do you get trainers? This is where you gotta go to recruit. You click on recruit, and sometimes you have uh, the little token already, like I have right here. I'm gonna use it, and this is how you recruit. You just goes in there and it does this little special effect. I'll show you right now. Pow and. And there we go, you can view them. And I didn't get anything good. So I'm gonna buy about like four of these just to see if we can get an ultra rare. We'll check it out. All right, so let's check this out. Hopefully we can get something good. Um, let's check this one. Nothing good here. Nope, nothing good. We recruited 300, so there's an achievement there. Uh, let's check the next one. Hopefully we can get something. But as you can see guys, I mean, they're not, they're not always here. I'll get a guarantee one again right here. Let's just check it out. See, hopefully we can get something good. Maybe we do, maybe we don't, never know. Yeah, we got Boominger, Boominger, so nothing too crazy. Um, But guys, that's basically it. I'm gonna use this last one because it's, uh, it's one there, so it doesn't matter. Uh, let's see. Hopefully, it can turn into a gold. It did not turn into a gold. All right. Oh, here we go. Hold up. Oh, guaranteed ultra rare. I need one more. So if I get one more ticket, we'll get the ultra rare guaranteed. So that's good. Good to look at. Um, but guys, other than that, that's it. That's basically it. You got to develop there. Uh, you know how to do that now. I mean, there's nothing else to talk about other than the core cube, but. I don't really have anything for that, so that's basically it. I mean, if you got any other questions on what to do or how to do something or maybe I didn't talk about, please let me know in the comments down below. I was just trying to make a video to where you could get an idea of how to play it. Uh, if y'all want to play against me, DBR Royals, you know, I don't know if you can add friends or not. I mean, let me see. Well, I don't know. I don't know if you can. Uh, let me know in the comments down below if you can. You'll probably find out before me. All right, now, guys, please like and subscribe to the I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.